Now it's time to add an assignment to this um, learning module. So go to the module one people learning module, go to create assessment and go down to assignment. So select assignment, give it a name, let's say module one assignment, instructions. So I'm going to add um, a Word document, which is a worksheet onto it. So save the onto your computer. So these are the instructions for the uh, for the student. Assignment files. Um, let's browse the content collection. We've already uploaded a document. So it's in here: course content, learning modules, module one and it would be the unit one worksheet which is a word document and then select it click on submit so we've added that there points possible let's say there's a possible 10 points for it um, you can add a rubric if you want um, by selecting a previously created one or you can create a new rubric i won't do that at the moment um, how many attempts just maybe a single attempt or make the assignment available I want to track the number of views. Again, you can limit availability. You can maybe keep it open for just one week. The due date, and say the due date for the assignment would be the 25th of December, end of the day. Recipients, all students get it individually. Once you've done that, click on Submit. So you may want to um, edit this um, to show the due date. So let's just edit again. And let's put the due date in here. Due date, December 25, 2011. We can change the text color if we want. Let's say we want a, a red color and apply. And you might want to bold it as well. So now we have the due date in there, submit. So if we go to student mode, let's just have a look at this. Student mode, module one assignment. Okay, the information comes up. There's the due date in red. The assignment materials, there's the, the file. Instructions. Okay, so when they want to, to submit the file, they browse their computer and then upload this file. They can add some comments and then finally they'll click on submit.